The past couple of weeks, among the many people demonstrating in Charlotte, we've seen Hornets and Panthers players. Sports anchor Matt Harris shows us what's driving these two players as they work towards a better future. Trey Boston and Nick Batum have had two different paths to the Queen City, but among their reasons for peacefully protesting, one common denominator, their sons. I wasn't born in this country. Nick Batum moved to the U.S. when he was 19 and has faced racism. Do people do monkey stuff or throw bananas at us? Stuff? Yes, I, I faced that as a young kid uh, over in Europe. Batum has global perspective. The day I went with my wife to the protest in Charlotte, that was the same protest in Paris with close to 100,000 people in the street. Panther safety Trey Boston also recognizes the far-reaching impact of using his platform. This is all over the world, people screaming um, uh, systemic oppression, systemic racism, um, social injustice. Batum and Boston are on the same team when it comes to why making a change is important. You know, my son's 14 months, so I'd never really you know, have had to envision that being my son yet. I have a four-year-old son who's going to school. He's mixed, he's not really white, he's dark skin too. Not just protesting for their sons, but for a better future for all of us. I've envisioned this fight being for me, other people's sons, um, other people's brothers, uncles, fathers. I just want to make sure I can be part of the solution, maybe help for my son later. Don't have to face it. In Charlotte, I'm Matt Harris.